So Prezi gives a lot of ways for you to edit and style text. In order to do that, let us insert a text first. So let us go to insert and let us go to text. Once you do that, a text will appear. So you can actually drag it, drag it around and increase the size and so forth. You can also type in the, you can increase the writing area just like that and increase the size. So you can go over here and type in anything. For example, this is a test sentence, just like this. So test sentence is typed down. You can actually press enter and a new line will ac actually appear. So this is new line as you can see. So if you want to format the text, you can actually see that everything is over here. So the menu has scenes according to the text that I actually chose right here. So you can select individual text and then change it as well or select whole bunch of text and change it as well. For example, I can change this new line and then increase its size just like that. So only uh, the text, uh, text that text is being affected right here. Suppose you want to bold this text right out there, so you can click bold. So let us see what these um, options actually do. So these are different uh, text styles over here. For example, I have body text right here. You can change that these are actually presets. You can change it to title right here. You can change it to subtitle. You can change it to body, just like that. You can change it to subtitle too. So let me just select all of it so you can apply this. Go over here, change it to body, right? Select this all, change it to subtitle too right here. Just select this, double click select the text over here you can go over to body you can go to body 2 and so forth so these are different textiles that you can apply right there there are different fonts as well which you can choose so let's say for example for new line i want to change the font so you can go over here choose from the list of fonts but unfortunately you cannot add your own fault font in prezi so you can just go over here select the font that you want and then that font will be applied over here just like this as you can see but it applies the font to all of the uh, text right here. So if you want a different font, then you should make a new text box and then apply the font right there if you want different styles um, in the same sentence or so, so forth. So you can actually go over here. This is, this decrease the, decreases the font size over here. Once you click, there's no numerical value over here or you can increase the font size right here. The bold is disabled because this font does not suppose bold. So let me change this into another font which actually does. And I can see that the bold option is actually there. You can italicize this as well. And over here, you can also choose a background color as you can see. So you can go over here. There are different background colors that you can choose. So you were to click this, then the background color of the text box actually changes. You can see that the background color actually changes just like that. So let us just go over here into background color and you can see that you can change the opacity so you can bring this down and here it is not that clear. Let me just bring the text box over here onto this section and I can see that the background is actually there. So you can change the background color from over here just like that. Increase the opacity, decrease the opacity and so forth. Here's the color as well. So there's the text color that you can choose. So you can choose white over here if you want to. You can choose standard color and so forth. But for text color itself, there is no opacity setting. So you have to choose the one which best suits you, right? But usually in text, we don't use opacity anyways. These are the alignment options right here. So you can left align it, center align it over here, right align it or justify it. So for justification, you need a longer sentence. So let me just uh, type that in for you. So let us go over here and I'm going to say justify the sentence this is an example text all right there you go so you can see that justification is actually being done over here and the left uh, and everything seems balanced out over here on the right side so you can go over here you can fully left align it click over here fully left align it over here or you can justify it um, in a left align way that's the bullet list as well so if you want to add in bullets you can actually go over here and bullet points are actually added in right over here there's a decrease indentation and the increase indentation over here. So you can increase the indentation from the left side or decrease it over here, just like that. You can select it, double click it, you can select the text, just like this. Increase and decrease the indentation right here, just like that. So that is how you can work, uh, uh, work and edit with text inside of Prezi. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.